Welcome to 20 Questions, the show where I ask 20 questions and you answer them, and I will grade you based on your performance. Today, we have Bugboy78. Say hi. Hey, hey, it's me. It's Bugboy78, everyone's favorite. If you're new around here, I'm the Big Craig, and I'll be your host this evening. I will, I will ask this contestant right here 20 questions. There are four separate columns. We have the history column, the math column, the opinion round, and the hard round. The first two rounds were AI-generated questions by the ChatGPT bot. So, you can get 50 points uh, in total for your performance this evening. How are you Good feeling? Night. How are you feeling this evening? Are you confident as your first as the first contestant for 20 questions? Buddy, buddy, I'm always confident. You know why? Because I'm bug boy fucking 78. Love it. Okay. Now, you can play along at home. However, you're not getting anything if you win and neither will he. So, let me read you your rights. You have not got a right to use a computer, cellular device of any kind. You cannot look anything up. Do you understand? Okay. Yeah. You may... Also, can I use a keyboard? No. You have one phone a friend. Which means if you are stuck on a question, you may phone or message one friend the answer. We um, have a loyalty program here, so I'm just going to assume that you're not cheating in any way. Because I respect you. To a degree. Okay, question number one. Who was the first president of the United States? I don't fucking know. Washington? Well, can I have a first name, please? I need full na name. George Washington. Correct. The first president of the United States was indeed George Washington. That is one point. Let me... Washington? My... I thought it was a washing machine. Okay. Question number two. What was the cause of the American Civil War? I don't fucking know. They had a civil war. Oh! That... Okay. I think, I think I know what this is about, like, if it's about the... Close enough. It says slavery and states' rights, so we'll just say yes for that. <laughs> Close enough. No. Round number two was the maths round. Oh, fuck. Now, if it makes you feel any better, I could not answer a single one of these. Anyway, what is the area... <laughs> of a circle with a radius of five centimeters. You may have paper for this if you want paper. No, I don't know this. I Can you solve the system of equa- One second. That. Remember, you can phone a friend. Remember that. I don't want to. Okay. Oh, all right. Actually, now that I think about it, what, what phone your math question? teacher. I can't call my fucking math teacher. Hey, um, hello, Ray. Welcome. Uh, this is a show thing. Welcome to 20 Questions. Bug has asked to call a friend to help him with some math questions. Would you be able to help him? You are being recorded. Sure. I don't know English means I like I don't know what the fuck words means. So uh this. Can you help me with this? Because I don't know what the fuck is does this mean. Uh well I'll tell you one thing. There's one set of numbers. Or number. Ooh, that's throwing a throwing a throwing a, a, a spanner into the mix. Oh, we have finished round one, which is a history round, round two, which is the maths round, and now we're on to the opinion round. We have five sets of questions. Each will be... Now, these questions are worth a bit more. They're worth three points each. Now, you might be asking yourself, why? Because you will be graded on the answer. Whether I like the answer or not, you'll be graded on why you like that answer, and you'll be graded on the overall performance of presentation of that answer. You may give a PowerPoint presentation if you would like to. So, first question in the opinion what? round. What's your favorite season of Fortnite and why? Okay. Ooh. Okay. I swear no, to God, if it's season two, you're getting a stick right up to the bum. <laughs> Is 
five of these awesome. questions we can't take 10 minutes like okay uh, we got we okay we got the Fortnite thing out of the way we needed to keep that in to keep all the nine-year-olds interested now i have written down your i've written down your results on this particular question i will show you my as my notes i said good answer now i'm liking this answer because it's actually a good season you picked okay it you didn't pick anything like you didn't pick like season two or like chapter three season four or like um did you just say season two yeah so you didn't pick any of that which it good answer that that's that's a and then you got structured opinion now you see you you put it all into little segments and i'm liking that i'm liking that uh and you did it all on the spot so i'm liking that and you also had <laughs> another point i wrote down was just overall good so that's nice and the final point was uh, to be fair let's be realistic it was a bit smelly so that's a two out of three on the fortnite question whoa, whoa, whoa. What, what was it a bit smelly just I don't know, I just wrote the on my note, it just says bit smelly, so, you know. What, what, what do you mean a bit smelly? I don't know, it just says bit smelly, so I assume past you me... You write it, you wrote it! I assume past me at a point, I just didn't finish writing it, so... Okay, well, so that's two out of three on, the, on that part. Okay, <laughs> next question. What is your favourite hobby and why? This is a three oh marker. Oh fucking god. Uh, that... That might be a bit tricky. That's why I'm because asking. I have a lot of hobbies. Like, I will have. For example, I have. I play the keyboard. I play video games. I build. Pick out of one. Room. Pick one. You're not getting graded on this answer. We don't need okay. essays. Do, do video games count? Sure, but you have to give me a, a reasonable explanation. Okay. Uh, Tell me when I can start. You, you could have started go. four minutes ago. Like, give me a go. 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 Who do you think so, you are? video games. Why do I like video games? Well, first of all, they're a fun Rhetorical way question. to spend your time. They're like basically any other hobby, except, well, it's not very... You don't push anything forward, but... The joystick. The beautiful thing about video games is they're a form of art. For example, I have played Fortnite. Oh, we're not allowed to say that name around here anymore. <laughs> We've had the segment, it's I, over I, now. <laughs> <laughs> I've played it for a few years, uh, mainly because it, it keeps changing, you know? It's not thin. For this, you said a rhetorical question at the beginning. I'm liking that little bit of little bit of ingenuity you put in there. It really threw me off. I was like, whoa, why does he like video games? And for that, that has to have at least one point. Number Point number two that I've written down is Virgin. Now, this gets some pity points behind it. And point number three, you get a third point for that. You know what? Third point. Why did I get now, a, point, a point for quote-unquote Virgin? Now... Bro. For the third question in this round, these are taking a lot, lot longer. The opinion round is always going to be the hardest round. Uh, let's never mind. Uh, if you had one superpower, what it would, what it would be, what would it be? <laughs> yes, yes, I've been contemplating this for a long time. I've Super tried. Speed. I had about fifty different opinion questions, and I tried, and I put loads of them down. But then I thought I need five, and I don't want to give you all the good ones, so I put so a few others that are a bit stinky in here. This is a good one for me, mainly because I have thought about many uh superpowers and for me it would be super speed mainly Why? because oh uh, mainly because i love this basic i i really love the idea of someone going faster than anyone else and especially after seeing x-men and all the all of the quick server scenes where basically everything is slowed down for him and he just runs past and just saves an entire mansion while it's exploding. I just find that really fun, you know? I, I, the concept is fun to play around with. And not only in the movies, oh, but I if, to if I it. had this power personally, I would do a lot of uh, shenanigans, a lot of jokes, a lot of 
pranks on people and it would be a good form of transportation like somebody needs to meet me right now some my grandmother is at the hospital boom i'm there you know what i mean uh-huh and that concludes my point okay okay good i'm liking the length of that you know what i was going to give you two oh. points but for that i'm giving you three points just because it wasn't four years long okay and Ooh. The, the, the I didn't write anything down until like you until like you were four sentences away from finishing. So the only word I wrote down is shenanigans. So you know that's pretty fun. So the fourth <laughs> question out of five in this round, we have one more round after this called the hard round, and that's what they call me. Um, if you were allowed to do anything, if you were allowed to do anything you want for a day, what would you do? Well, I I actually would have two answers for this. I'm gonna go need with one. the first one. Need one. Well, the, the other one is pretty short, so I'm just gonna say that I'm the other one. Getting a deduced answer. Uh, you don't, basically. You don't get <laughs> basically, <laughs> basically, I would probably uh, do like a marathon of a movies if that counts as one action. Sure. Uh, like, I would probably like binge watch a bunch of uh, Star Wars in the continuity that they actually happened, that the things happened, you know? Uh, but on the, the other thing I was thinking is uh, your mom. Now, okay. Now, <laughs> I did say, now Bug, I'm not gonna lie, I'm sorry, I'm sorry to speak to you here, but this is your weakest opinion round so far because, right, not only did you ignore the question entirely, the question was if you could do one thing for a whole day and you picked, oh, I'm going to watch like 17 different Star Wars films. I'm sorry. Well, mate, it's like... a one, it's one then... action. I, I just asked you if it's one action and you said, yeah. No, because you said, you're just... okay, fine, fine, fine. We'll give you one point for that, okay? And then, then, I don't get much reasoning behind it, all right? You can't edit your answers now, by the way. And third of all, um, the comment at the it end was happen. very harsh. And I'm sorry, but that's going to have to give one point. And the the editor's note I'm going to put in is... Um, nothing. Anyway, if you wanted... If you, here's the last one. I don't know where I got this from, but I have it. If you became yeah, mayor mom. of your town, what's the first thing you would do? Communism. Sure. One mark. Final round, the hard round, which we've I've already made a joke about, so I can't say it again. Now this is a bit different. I have gone out and gotten the most impossible to answer questions that you shouldn't know. However, I've done a bit of a twist here. I'm gonna give you multiple choice, A, B, and C. Can you stop? This is gonna make me very Why? difficult. Stop posting images in the chat you freak i'm gonna have to edit it out what what, what? i'm not doing anything you're not what being you're you not mean? you're not coming back at this rate you're not you're not coming back for round two mate okay sorry sorry yeah that's yeah. what i thought how many people die each day is it a 150,000, b 75,000, or c 200,000? that's not uh, uh. I'm pretty sure none of that. Trust me, I did one Google search. It's confirmed. <laughs> so, again, what are the options? 150,000, 75,000, 200,000. 200,000. You're wrong. It's 150,000. What color is my wall? Is it A, green, B, white, or C, blue? White. You are factually incorrect, my friend. It is blue. You know I'm colorblind, right? <laughs> That's not my problem, mate. You got the question wrong. What's the weather right now in Peru? Is it A, sunny, B... Oh, I forgot to tell you. Um, <laughs> all five of these questions add up to 50% of the marks. They're five points each. And like so the others... So basically it's just random bullshit stuck together. At the end, yeah. So... What's the weather right now in Peru? Is it A, sunny, B, rainy, or C, uh, uh, snowy? <laughs> it's not I, fucking I, snowy. What's the other two ones? Sunny and rainy. Rainy. 
<laughs> You're actually incorrect, my friend. It is indeed sunny. <laughs> in Peru. Actually, listen. If they factually incorrect one more time, it's my word. I will factually incorrect your spine. Uh, you can't reach me, you smelly little man. Question number three, or four Tiny even. Insect. How many Dark Souls games are there? Two, three, three, or four? You are factually correct on that one, my friend. There are three Dark Souls games that gives you I five. Dark Souls three. Bro. Well done. S that gives. Wait, wrong piece of paper. Where's the? I don't know. Um. <laughs> uh, um, as of right now, what are the total views on the Big Craig YouTube channel? Is it 64,000, 134,000, or 543,000? 100. Yeah. That gives you 10. That gives you uh, that gives you ten points on the on the on the final round. Now, if you give me approximately half an hour, I will come back to you with your final result. Bugus Boyus, I can proudly hang on. Let me get this off my screen. Okay, I can proudly announce you, uh, say you that on the twenty questions first episode uh, premiere, you have indeed gotten twenty four and a half points out hey. of fifty. I did it! You almost got 50%. Now, if we were grading <laughs> GCSEs, <laughs> that would at least be a C. Winks at camera. I don't... Yeah, yeah. now, I need to... Yeah. Uh, what the fuck is a GTAC? GCSE, General Certificate of Secondary Education. I isn't going to make him go, Oh, that's, that, oh, that's, that's what that means. That. Yeah, but like... British. British, moment. British Wait, moment. What is the comment? Are you like publishing this somewhere or something? Yes. YouTube. The second oh. channel, baby. Bug oh, boy, do. what would you rate your experience here today? Um, honestly, I would like to probably thank uh, a lot of people, uh, especially my mother, who is watching at home as I do this. She is very proud of me. I've come a long way to join your show. I am very thankful for you, Mr. Craig, for inviting me and giving me uh, such an opportunity. Also, I would like to say uh, the cameraman keeps staring at me weird. Um, I, 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 I don't know what, what that means. Like, he keeps doing that weird wave thing with, with his hand. Is, that, is he, like, gay or something? Uh, I don't know. That's all Hi. the time we have for 20 Questions Episode 1 premiere. Tune in next time where we have a very mysterious guest show up and complete 20... Shut baby. up. Shut up. Where we have <laughs> another mysterious guest to give us uh, answers to questions that I've made up. We don't know who that is yet. However, I'm going to pretend like I do. You're going to love this next one. We it's don't know who it's going to be. It's going to be... Me. It's going to be me.